Hello lovelies, welcome to my kitchen. Today we're going to cook uh, one of the special that I know because this is one of uh, my children's favorite and we're going to cook uh, low carb carbonara. Please join me. Before we start cooking, I'm going to show you our ingredients. Uh, two onions, lemon, three cloves of garlic, basil, thyme, pepper, oregano, bacon of course, olive oil, white wine, cream, chicken broth, beef broth, salt, parsley for garnish, and of course because we are going to cook low carb, I don't eat pasta, so it's forbidden, so I have a spaghetti cochette. Now we start to prepare our ingredients. We're going to cut or slice the onion. We have to slice it very fine. It's supposed to be very finely sliced. like this finely slice yeah now the onion is ready we're going also to slice the the garlic also find this light yeah like that three gloves garlic that's enough normally uh, some people when they cook carbonara they don't use garlic but for me it gives extra taste so I just do it now we're going to slice also our bacon not so Thin the slice just like this, um, and then it will pull apart like this. So that's good enough. Because my family will going to eat it also, I'm going to prepare pasta for them. So while I'm preparing the sauce, I'm going to prepare the pasta at the same time so it will be cooked at the same time. You know, preparing pasta is just water and you can put salt in the water. only if you are using um, dried pasta but if you are using fresh pasta you don't need um, you don't need to put in the water you can just mix it 
um, with the sauce together while it, uh, you are cooking and it's ready. Now that we are um, we are finished cutting the ingredients, we can start cooking the sauce.
delicious. If you love pasta, oh, this one is one of the best. Like I said, this is my kids' favorite.
one who really to cook it just to warm it so it was uh, so it's not completely cold because I wash it in a cold water. So now it's ready. Just close it. Turn off the heat of the pasta. Now it's completely ready. Now we go to my crochet spaghetti. I think it's enough. You know, I don't want to cook it so long because I hate when my vegetable is too soft. So I cook it in a very low heat. Just put a little bit of um, half a teaspoon of chicken broth to have a little bit of taste. Because it's not a problem anyway, if even you don't put it because the sauce is already tasty. So, I guess it's ready. Like I said, I don't want my vegetable to become too overcooked because I don't like that my vegetable is overcooked. So this is enough. Yeah, like this. I'm going to prepare my plate. So lovelies, thank you for watching. Um, I hope you enjoy watching my video. And if you do, please subscribe and put the thumbs up below. I will put all the ingredients in the description below anyway. So if you forget or yeah, it's easy to see if I put it down. So yeah, I hope you really enjoy watching it and See you next video and happy eating!